Hey, water signs, and welcome to my channel. This is your weekend love reading for um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for singles only. So um, if you're seeing somebody or waiting for somebody or what have you, look for my couples reading because this is for those of you who are super single and looking for love. So we will go in that order. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Spirit Angels. Thank you. Okay, Cancer, the Knave of Chalices. Pisces, the Three of Pentacles in reverse. And Scorpio, the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. And your guys' central theme is the Nine of Chalices. So, um... Yeah, with the Nine of Chalices being your um, central theme, you guys uh, are really finding emotional balance. Um, you have been able to heal and move past um, things of the past. Um, you're single and just really wanting um, to find real love. Some of you could be um, just out willy-nilly and all over the place. Um, this could be a, a number of a large number of partners, but nothing serious for some of you. Um, cancer, there's somebody in um, your guys' energy that is upset that you have moved on, that is um, mad about how things ended in the past. This this person's very frustrated. I'm going to get a clarifying card for Cancer's males. Um, cancer males, you guys could be the one that are very angry, very upset. You could have lost your last partner, um, due to them leaving and being with somebody else, or you're just finding out that there was somebody else and it's, it's making you, um, angry, uh, cancer females. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. So, um, cancer males, you could have, um, been dating a, uh, earth sign in the past and they decided to move forward, to move on. And this upsets you. Um, you're, you're hearing, you're getting news that they are with somebody else. You're very frustrated. Um, you could be writing this person an angry text. Uh, yeah, I'm just seeing a lot of frustration for cancer females. You are successfully moving, um, on successfully moving forward and you are, um, you have successfully healed your heart over this person of the past. Uh, you have now paved the way for you to be in a healthy relationship for you get for these, this cancer couple. Um, this was not healthy in your past, but you are going to meet somebody. Yeah, you are going to meet somebody cancer females. Um, they are an earth sign more than likely, uh, I'm seeing Capricorn as the most dominant energy, but it could be a Virgo and Taurus as well. Uh, yeah, so you're going to find success in that. And it's going to bring you stability. Yeah, it's going to bring you many blessings as well. In the next three months is what I see for you Cancers um, singles. You guys are having somebody come in, a serious relationship come in. Um, you, you could be seeing other people in that meantime, but nothing serious. All right, Pisces males, Pisces females. Okay, so um, you guys have the three of pentacles in reverse. I'm going to flip it up just for a second, though. Um, in this card, you see she's like leaped into his arms. Like she trusts him to catch her when um, she falls or when she jumps. But in the reverse, you're hesitant to trust anybody. You're hesitant to trust anybody that comes into your um, your space, wanting love, interested in you. Um, Pisces males, you guys have uh, regained a beautiful sense of balance. You guys have found your stability. You found your feet. Um, you are working on yourself. You're doing great in your career. You... Uh, you could be a, a single father. Um, 
with some sort of custody or visitation with your children. You're finally getting that relationship back together. So you're, you're kind of hesitant to allow love to come in because you're very content single. Um, but I do see that somebody is moving in towards you. Yeah. And you are going to end up taking the leap, uh, with this person within the next four weeks. I see somebody coming into your space, Pisces males. Pisces females, you also are hesitant to trust anybody new coming in. Um, even though you have wished for this person to come forward, um, to come towards you, now that they're here, um, you're hesitant to give them a chance. You're hesitant to trust them enough to uh, to date them, to see them, to, to even get close um, at all. Uh, Within the next moon cycle, I see you guys having people come towards you. This is your wish granted. This is true love. You guys are hoping and wishing for true love. That is what this person is. Um, could be Aquarius, but I'm mostly seeing Aries for both of you guys. Uh, there's also uh, yeah, a Gemini or a Sagittarius could be coming into your space as well. Um, but most definitely... Uh, Aries is important to you for this. Yeah. Um, also, for some of you Pisces, this is for a different group of you, you're going to find the love of your life. Your soulmate is coming in in the time of Aquarius, which is the end of January, beginning of February. Um, that will be your life partner for this group of you. Um, <clears throat> Scorpio, you guys have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. So um, in the upright, it looks like this. He's trying to get her attention. Um, she's kind of, uh, ignoring him or not really interested. Um, that's in the reverse. So somebody has caught your attention, Scorpios. I see you daydreaming about this person. Whoa. Wow. Wow. Okay. Somebody's definitely got your attention guys. Um, for the males, you got the Empress. So it could be a Taurus, could be a Libra um, that is coming that you have met. You have met this person as of recently. They got your attention. You've gotten theirs um, for Scorpio males. This person has a lot of love, a lot of zest for life. This person wants to create something with you, create something new, something of beauty and passion and go for it because this person is amazing. Um, this also, uh, this person could come towards you in the time of Libra which is coming up, um, I think, uh, mid-September to, to mid-October. Um, that's when you're going to meet this person. You're going to know. They're going to get your attention. You're going to know who this is right away. This is going to be a very successful relationship. It's going to be just one of pure love. Scorpio female, somebody's definitely got your attention too. You have the two of cups. So somebody is... Um, coming towards you. Uh, I'm seeing in the, in the next eight weeks, eight to 12 weeks is what I'm hearing. Um, when you meet this person, you are going to have a sense of knowing them before. This is somebody from your past life. Um, this is somebody you have not been with this lifetime. This is a new person, but when your eyes, um, come together, there's sparks you're going to know also, um, they are most definitely going to capture your attention. Uh, yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, this reading is a lot of, a lot has to do with in the future, except for cancer. Um, I see you guys, uh, you're getting angry this weekend, <laughs> but the other two of you, yeah, you're scared, um, Pisces, but your people are coming in very quickly and, um, Scorpio. Oh my God. Your people are coming. Amazing. You guys all got playfulness for the weekend. So, um, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to shine. Um, I can't help but see that on the bottom for some of you water signs. You may be having a reconciliation. Somebody from your past is coming back this weekend. But for the majority of you, um, just have fun this weekend. Go out and play. Go out and have a good time. Enjoy yourselves. And um, yeah, yeah, love yourself first. 
So um, a lot of you are still doing some healing, um, and but that's okay. You can still have fun while you heal. You can still go out and enjoy life. Um, just set your boundaries. Self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So, And also, um, children could be affecting uh, your love life. So you could be holding back uh, approaching love because you don't want your children to be hurt or um, maybe somebody has children and is not wanting to start anything with you. But um, I do see much, much beautiful love coming in for you guys in the next um, couple weeks. So keep being strong, keep working on yourself and go out and have fun. Go enjoy your friends, enjoy life and true love will find you guys. So I hope you enjoyed your reading my single water signs and I will see you next time. Much love.